brilliant. I'm dead, dead proud to have, have painted something which is about Manchester's industry, about Manchester's heritage. Manufacturing is, it's brilliant. I think it's fantastic what you've done. Amazing. My family history is in manufacturing. My great, great grandfather had a glass manufacturing business in Ancoats um, in the 18, I think it was the 1860s. And um, that went right through to the 1950s. Um, and the other side of my family are in the hat industry in Stockport. It really works in such a big space. I'm dead relieved actually. I think that is one of the biggest things I get when I see one of my paintings in situ. It's like, oh thank God it works. Some paintings I will enjoy all the way through, but that's rare. A lot of them can be a bit of a battle. Halfway through a painting, you know whether it's going to work or not and you just have to persevere and go through this stage of like that doesn't look right, that doesn't look right, that's because it all comes together eventually. First of all we, we thought about doing a skyline so we weren't, weren't just going to have this mill on its own, we were going to have some of the local buildings and the local landscape but it just didn't seem to work in terms of making this building the focus because it's such a huge building, it's so massive, it needed, it needed the whole canvas to itself. Working out perspective on, on such a massive scale was the biggest challenge. You haven't got a ruler that's as long as the canvas, <laughs> and you're trying to kind of sketch out these things with the ruler, and you have to stand back. It takes so much longer because you're having to stand like to the other side of the room instead of just step back once. The windows were also very, <laughs> very challenging, but really, really therapeutic. So once I'd worked out, all my perspective and the, all the gaps in between the windows. If I made one mistake, then like 10 windows down the line, the window would be like lopsided like that. So I had to get it just right. But once I got it right, it was really nice because it was dead therapeutic because I love just painting little lines and, you know, really perfectionist. So it was nice. Bit of a painting trance thing going on. Thank, thankfully it worked. Phew! <laughs>